what's up everyone today on this video tutorial for Adobe After Effects I will show you how to get a little wiggle to your comp inside of After Effects CS4 now this uh, technique will work with previous version of uh, Adobe After Effects which I don't exactly know which ones but if you're using uh, 7 uh, CS3 or CS4 it will work don't worry about it alright so open up uh, After Effects and we need to create a new project or a new comp so go to file, new, oh, composition, just new composition, sorry, was in a Photoshop mode. <laughs> right, so composition, new composition, and we'll just name it Wiggly, and we'll set it to the NTSC DV preset. We'll just uh, make the square pixel so it looks better for me. And 29.97 um, frames per second seems to be a good start. Uh, 15 frames, uh, 15 seconds, good, advanced, you don't really need to change anything in here. And everything looks good. Okay, so press OK. So our composition has been created. Now let me actually, here we go, put it up. Alright, so now what we're going to do is we're going to create a background to it and add some text and a camera. And the camera basically is going to move around. Okay, now. Uh, we need to go to layer, new, solid. I will just make this solid a, I chose mine to be a uh, pale gray royal blue solid, which is basically going to be renamed BG for background, uh, make comp size, click on OK. Alright, now we need to actually get a um, mask, an uh, actual elliptical. So to take the ellipse tool, just double click, automatically fill that up. Now go down there and just go to the feather and just feather it a whole bunch. And that should be good. There you go. So it looks good. Okay, now we need to actually uh, get our text. So let's put the title action safe. If you don't know the shortcut, it's the uh, apostrophe, or you can just uh, go down there, little, little icon here, title, action safe, there you go. Alright, so take your uh, text tool, select your font, size, actually going to bump it up now. I set mine to be impact, and we're going to have a, uh, actually, kind of a light gray, not exactly white. And we'll just enter it here, and say... Wiggle, sorry. It's gonna be like so, and we're just gonna make it look uh, yeah. look a little better. I'm just gonna increase the size just a little bit. And uh, sorry, increase the width here. There you go. So now I'll take your move tool and just move it down so it looks it matches here. You can actually zoom out with the uh, scroll so it actually fits there. So we need to actually move it a bit over here. There you go. Okay, so. Alright, so now that we're done with that thing, you can just get rid of the ac action safe. Now, we need to make this layer to be 3D. Now, not the background layer, just the text layer. So just a little. Uh, switch here. If you don't have this, you have this, just click there or press F4 and make sure it's 3D. Now, go to layer, new camera. We're just gonna keep it to the 15mm presets. Click on OK. Alright, so now it's when we need to actually make our wiggle. Now, wiggle is an expression that will uh, actually modify the position of the camera. So press P to bring up the position and Alt click on the stopwatch and type in wiggle. And now the parameters for this is how many times per, per seconds and how many pixels. So we're going to say around 5 times per seconds and we're going to move it around uh, let's say 50. So now if we move the 
camera is moving as well. We can actually make it move. Oh, sorry. Actually, make it move a bit more. So you have a little wiggle to your text. Now you can um, put this uh, expression also on the wiggle uh, layer itself. So you're in a position. I'll click, and you can just say wiggle. For example, you see it wiggles a whole lot, much more than the camera itself. So 150 is a bit too much. I put it to 50. Let's render it as uh, half, and we'll bring it down to about this. All right, so let's do a RAM preview of this. There you go. We have a wiggling text. So you can uh, do this wiggle. Try to moderate the wiggle because it can hurt your eyes a little bit. So. And you can also do the same wiggle. You can actually copy and you can paste it into the uh, oh, sorry. Oh, click. And you can actually paste it there. Actually make it 100. And uh, have a little fun with it. That w moves way too much because I mean, 5 times per second is big, it's a, it's a good amount. 2 times per second. Let's see. It's a bit more moderate, and the camera actually makes it move uh, forward, backward, actually the track of the camera. So. There, we go. there we go. That's it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it, and make sure to follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash techfulltuts, and uh, make sure to uh, subscribe to the channel, comment, rate, subscribe, do whatever you want. And I'll see you guys next time for some other tech full tutorials. Alright, see you guys, bye.